Good afternoon. I'm with Dr. Mohammed Atikur Rahman Ahad. He is the professor of University of Dhaka. He is a senior member of IEEE and also associate professor of Osaka University from Japan. How are you, sir? Uh, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Sir, you are working with vision and sensor board activity and gait analysis. How these findings can help us in medical field? Uh, thank you for your nice question. Actually, uh, vision-based or wearable sensor-based human activity recognition or gait recognition can be extremely useful for uh, hospital, healthcare, and elderly people. And in Japan, especially Japan and New Zealand and other countries where elderly people are increasing, they are doing a lot of work. If countries like Bangladesh as well, we have huge opportunities because if you go for sensors, which are very easy to get and cheaper, but if we can make a smart systems, then uh, we can uh, explore it and get much more benefit, which will be beneficial for developing countries as well. Of course, for grassroots level poor people, it's very difficult, but um, I mean, there are lots of people who can get the benefits from this kind of systems. And once we can develop something uh, with low cost technologies, but at the same time, quality technologies, then it can be um, uh, step by step improved and uh, maybe more useful for other community as well. Yeah. Sir, if our graduate students want a scholarship in Japan, what kind of research field they should choose? Oh, that's a tough question. Actually, there are lots of areas. Japan is a country or other countries are super special, special in Japan. I mean, they do excellent research in diversified areas. So I recommend that our students should consider um, those areas that they can do here. And it's not necessary that the same t similar topic should work, uh, I mean, should be done there. Uh, because they, get, they, they should get some kind of experience, good experience, original thought, and learning process, so that when they approach to someone, either Japan or elsewhere, the supervisor or professor can feel that, I mean, th this guy or, I mean, uh, is uh, okay to work. Uh, I mean, any topic I'll give or, uh, him or her, yeah. So any topic is okay, yeah. And if somebody needs to discuss, I can uh, assist remotely, it's possible. Uh, hopefully, yeah, that will be done, yeah. Sir, will you please share your experience about this SDI conference? Uh, uh, this is my first uh, visit to Green University, this campus. Uh, I must say that as the first conference, this is an excellent one. Uh, the panel of speakers are wonderful. I mean, uh, they are excellent people. I, I congratulate the university and the authorities for arranging such a initiative, and it should be continued. And one point is that, I mean, we organize a conference annually, but uh, we should uh, try to develop our students for the next six months so that they, their papers can be or their works can be published here as well. If they cannot publish good quality paper because undergraduate students, at least they can have lots of poster presentations and make more brainstorming sessions and tutorials so that they can learn better. And involving more students, look, uh, your students and other students, even uh, token uh, I mean, registration, it is necessary so that they can learn. And uh, after the conference, I recommend that uh, you make a small session uh, from which you can get the feedback from the students so that whether they have learned anything uh, because uh, we speak and many presenters but whether they have learned anything this is important and based on the, that uh, pattern you can tune in future I mean not only organizing a conference but at the same time developing next generation and I talked with the Vice Chancellor and Pro Vice Chancellor as well that as data mining Big data AI is leading the world, and I mean, if someone has good skill, they can get job. I mean, globally without uh, any good CGP and others. So it is important to uh, think about the syllabus as well, so that if you can change the syllabus, like 20, 30, uh, 25 percent towards that goal, that would be extremely beneficial for the future. I mean, concentrated degree, like we give 100, about 150 universities, we are giving computer science and engineering or triple E and so on. What about uh, considering that uh, specialized little bit, not officially outside, but switching some of the subjects? Uh, it, uh, it is everywhere, uh, I mean, uh, in the global, if you look at the syllabus, syllabuses are different in different universities. Some are giving concentration on one area, another university, uh, I mean, they try on, I mean, another area. So uh, this university should do this, I think, yeah.
and uh, huge land, lots of money. The you have to convince the, I mean, uh, uh, trustee, board of trustee of this university to spend more money on uh, this kind of research uh, and development. And throughout the year, long term, like uh, plan should be there, like two years or five years and ten years. What is the goal? I mean, uh, towards uh, I mean research and development. Yeah, and there are many uh, researchers nowadays. We, we visit every year. We can try to help if there are some good coordinations and collaborations. Yeah. Thank you, sir, for your time.